operates her own business called Vrelos and Media. The company designs and manufactures bags and accessories that are found all over the country in retail shops as well as online. Christy is a proud mother of three children, Hunter who is nine, and twin daughters Riley and Emerson who are six. Her family lives here in Devils Lake where her husband grew up and also attended Lake Virginia State College. Christy grew up in Salford, Manitoba and first came to Devils Lake to play volleyball at Lake Virginia State College. She then went on to play at Mayville State and ended up graduating from the University of North Dakota with a bachelor's degree in communications. Mm -hmm. Ms. Christy Renner. It seriously feels like it's just yesterday that I was up here getting my own diploma from Lake Region State College. And here I am, I get to talk to you guys at your graduation. Although my morning was a little bit different than 14 years ago today, I had to listen to Old McDonald's on the recorder 14 times for my son, feed my kids breakfast and get them ready for school in the morning. But um, it's a great honor to be here today to talk to you guys. I'll start with a little introduction on myself. Um, like I said, I graduated from Lake Region State College with my liberal arts degree in 2002. I came to Lake Region to play volleyball from South Park, Manitoba. And then as Dr. Darling had mentioned, I played at Mayville. And then I graduated from UND with a bachelor's degree in communications. After college, I hit the ground running for the corporate career in Minneapolis, where I eventually became an application consultant, as well as a product project manager for a software company. I traveled all over the country and overseas to work with some of the nation's largest retailers to set up, train, and maintain their maintenance software programs. After four years in the city, my family, who was my husband and son Hunter at the time, decided to move to Grand Forks, and I took a position at a local software company that developed tax filing software. I quickly moved up to the director of new product development, and I worked with some of the country's most popular accounting systems. At 28 years old, I had a pretty impressive career, but an opportunity came up for my husband to purchase a dental practice here in Devil's Lake. So we decided to pack up our family, which had grown to include my twin daughters, Riley and Emerson, and move ourselves to Devil's Lake. So with the background in software and three small kids, that pretty much ended my corporate career. So by design and not necessarily by choice, I became a stay-at-home mom. But Everything happens for a reason, and that is when my business, Rylos and Mimi, started. Rylos and Mimi are actually nicknames of my twin daughters, Riley and Emerson, that were given to them by my son Hunter when they were preemies in the NICU. Being a stay-at-home mom allowed me to have a lot more time to do things that I love doing, so I started doing things that I did as a kid, like sewing again and designing and working with fabrics. Pretty soon I was asked to sell my products and I put some online on a popular website called Etsy and then went to craft fairs. And before I knew it, I had retail stores knocking on my door or giving me calls or shout outs from social media to sell their products in their stores. So today, Rylos and Mimi products are found in 16 retail stores throughout the country along um, seven different states. We have our products on websites as well as um, on sites like Amazon and stuff like that. So the last couple of years have been really exciting. We've gotten to be on television. We were in the swag bags for the MTV Movie Awards last April. We've gotten to be on magazines. I'll actually be having Riles and Mimi in our first national magazine this summer. So it's been just a whirlwind of learning and experiences. So what I wanted to share with you today is what I believe is the most important influential reasons for a successful career in life. And it's some of the simplest pieces of advice that I can give you, and that is to take every person that you meet and treat them with respect and gain experiences with those people. Regardless of the industry that you're in, the people you face along the course of your life are very important. And you never know when or if a person will be valuable to your personal career or business growth. These are the people that will recommend you for jobs, will buy something from your business, will come to you for a service, will talk to other people in the community about you. And you don't always necessarily know who they are. It's important to treat every person you encounter, whether it's a classmate, teacher, coworker, or member in the community in a kind, respectful way. 
People never forget when a person is rude, inappropriate, or just plain ignored them. And they also never forget when a person is beyond nice, kind, funny, or respectful to them or other people around them. I have gained so many opportunities in my business just by people referring me to their friends or remembering me from a past event. A girl I actually went to Lake Regent State College with, who was a year ahead of me, saw some press on Rylos and Mimi and decided to reach out to me about carrying products in a store she now manages. I didn't know it at the time, but that has been an important part of my life. So when you're starting your career, make sure you volunteer for projects or help others as you're working. Take the time to learn something from someone even if it doesn't directly involve you. Call customers, stop by people's offices to say hi. Ask questions, make sure you say thank you. For a lack of a better term or a more appropriate term, I'm not saying that you need to suck up to everyone that you meet or treat everyone like a personal gain. You just need to make sure that you treat everyone with respect and also share those experiences with people. Just being likable on top of hard working is an easy way you can not only grow your career, but also your business your personal life. So as you start your next adventure, pretty much rem remember that pretty much every industry runs on customers. And customers are human beings. And we need to treat them in the most respectful way. Even a simple hey and a smile goes a long way. You never know who will play an important role. For some of you, Lake Region State College is the last step before you start your career, or it might be the first step before moving on to another college. I hope you, that you'll remember and be thankful for your experiences at Lake Region State College. I didn't necessarily know it at the time, but Lake Region has made a huge impact on my life. It's where I met my husband, the father of my three kids. Some of my best friends were sitting right here at graduation with me 14 years ago. A lot of my close friends that are in my life today were also here. A lot of my, the, a lot of the people that I, that I ran into here, whether they were teachers or other workers in the college, they are now my customers for my products and also my friends in the community. So continue to make those amazing memories with people you meet on the next journey in life. After all, this is the beginning of anything you want. Good luck and congratulations, Lake Region State College of 2016.